Hello, I'm Bini here. Are you trading full time, or are you thinking of trading for a living, or that you are just starting in your investment and trading journey? Today, I'd like to share with you my daily routine as as well as the method that I use to trade. I'm trading into multiple markets in the morning, the Hong Kong and Singapore stocks, and then in the afternoon and as well as the evening, different instruments such as forex, stocks, indices, commodities, and futures. And why is it that I can have so many different uh, markets and different instruments? All right, so that's what I want to share with you. I'm also an SGX Academy trainer with a fully accredited course with the International Banking and Finance of Singapore. I also train institutions and retailers in Singapore and worldwide, such as Australia, Indonesia, Hong Kong, and many other countries. Therefore, to know why I can handle so many instruments, right, so many different markets. I think the key thing that we need to do is to take a look at my trading screen. Here we go. This is my screen for the stocks. That's a Hong Kong listed stocks. More important is that I don't draw any lines. All these lines are automatically plotted based on the concept of the alien wash, okay, which is a concept of wash and rinse. What does it mean? It means that price has been artificially pushed to a certain levels and then it resumes it in its original direction. And of course, why am I able to trade into many different instruments? All right, I mean, um, to monitor so many different pairs at the same time, that's because I built certain automation for myself. Okay, take a look at what I have here in this screen. That's the Alien Wash dashboard. Okay, it's a dashboard that monitors into the different instruments real time, such as the different forex pairs, the different indices, and also even if you take a look at metals here or oil. All right, and what what's uh, up with today's trading? So today I have a trade in the um, oil. So that's the oil coming up as the most recent trade. All right, so we can take a look at oil, and of course that uh, we have dollar. So we have the euro dollar, and we have the um, Swissy and the dollar sing. All right, so all these are automatically pushed to me and alerted to me, so I don't need to go and hunt for trades. I just have to wait for trades to come. So that's give me leave me plenty of time to do some other things, including um, to be involved in my son's PSRE preparation. All right, before we get ready for my trades, let's watch a short video and see what Wash & Rinse is all about and the offers we have for you here. Traders and investors, are you tired of being washed and rinsed? After buying, price keeps dropping. You have no choice but to cut loss. Have you been washed by the market? Wash is a fake move often resulting in losses. Mysteriously, after your losses, price keeps going up. You should have made money, but you have exited your position already with losses. Have you just been rinsed? Rinse is a subsequent move in your original direction. Wash and rinse. How professional traders and big players have been cheating your money. Stop being washed and rinsed with the Alien Wash TAW course. Binny Ong developed the Alien Wash TAW strategy. With TAW, we combat these fake moves in the market and turn them into profitable trades. Get educated with TAW strategy. For a limited time, the first module of the TAW course is free. You will learn 1. The Wash and Rinse Phenomenon 2. Why TAW trades are explosive 3. How to trade TAW in many financial instruments, including stocks, indices, forex, and commodities. 4. Improve your profitability with TAW strategy. Good news! For a limited time, TAW Course Module 2 is 100% sponsored too. The full TAW course is free to you. What's more? Every signal is automated with TAW indicators. Never miss a good trade, never draw any complicated lines. Receive this suite of TAW indicators with our course. Learn, automate, master trading with TAW course. Attend free at onlineforexmaster.com.
All right, great. Now you know what wash and rinse is all about. And of course, you can take the free module in the Alien Wash. And of course, that's this uh, promotion uh, with the current the Alien Wash course, which is a full cash refund. Right now, um, we're going to have a look into the what the Tor dashboard is telling me. So I have a trade that happens about four hours ago into UK oil. So that is a CFDs in oil. The method can be used in oil and it can be used in stocks or forex or indexes or commodities, whatever you name it, whatever they're going to have here, it can be used. All right. So it's a very versatile method, meaning that once you learn a method, you can use it for many, many different instruments. All right, so we're going to start ready with the UK oil. So let's check the UK oil here. All right, I have the UK oil. I'm just going to take a look into the signal. As you can see, with all these arrows, the previous signal worked so well with the oil trade. Uh, of course, then there are trades which are mm, not doing well. For example, we had a recent buy signal. But that didn't really deter us because right now we are looking at a potential sell. Because with this buy that didn't really move up, there could be a chance of a wash and rinse. And of course, then we're going to draw in a line here. So that's a trend line. You can see that price has been pushed up right into a trend line okay right into a trend line as a resistance and then our indication is showing us potentially that might be a wash and rins that might be a sell signal for us okay so previously there was a buy it moved very nicely also based on the wash and rins and there was a sell also based on the wash and rins and was another sell signal that moved nicely also based on wash and rins another sell signal also based on wash and rins and this one also based on wash and rins and it moved so nicely for my previous oil trade i'm going to trade that again so what i did is that you know i'm going to drag in my um order size indicator which is a calculator so i'm going to define having a 0.5 percent risk of my account size okay uh with the setting of a stop loss here and the current and order price we're going to have the order size of 14 contracts so i'm going to trade in 14 contracts and this will allow me to reach 0.5 of my account size of course then our trade would not be done in a for a, a day chart but you will be done in a four hourly chart because we will always go into the lower time frame to conduct the trade all right now with the trade size calculated i'm going to put in a trade but i'm going to i'm just going to go into the lower time frame to check because what's our objective our objective is to make sure we have that better entry price so that we can increase our reward to risk ratio Okay, so the key thing is that in a course, which is the tall course, I will be teaching you how you can cascade into multiple time frame, how you can fine tune your trade to enter at that best price before it can before it explodes. All right, I'm at the lower time frame. We can see that there was a wash here. This is the wash because price has been artificially pushed up. Okay, and of course we see a failure. That's why there's a rinse. And that we're going to have that automation alerting me to say that, hey, look, please, Beanie, please take a look at oil. All right, then I'm not going to miss this trade. This is very, very important. Why? Because many times uh, we can find good trades, but then it's just not ready. So we want to have alerts. And we also want to have unbiased uh uh, clues to let us know that a trade is ready so i have lines all automatically drawn in all right to show me where is the wash and rinse all right best of all with the course you get all these indicators to alert you to draw the lines for you and to plot you the entries and exit all right so this is very important and of course i have to teach you how to do that okay so right now i'm just going to place in the trade all right, so I have everything keen here. I'm just going to click the cell because then the cell signal is ready. All right, so here's my trade all in and then we're just going to wait for what happened. And of course, then with the full set of tall indicators, we're going to look for more trades to come. All right, uh, what do we have here in the new day? So today is 7 September. Time now is 1.12 p.m. I just came back from a lunch. Um, so it's just a light lunch. But what do we have here? All right, we have the 
um, alert on pound kiwi and then an alert on kiwi yen. So that happens about 12 minutes ago. So that's a 1 p.m. alert. As I mentioned, I trade only. I look at the screen every four hours. All right. And then I get alerted by this. Okay. So I'm just going to have a look into the kiwi yen and then let's see what's up. Now, um, wow. Take a look at kiwi yen. So this is my screen. Um, and, uh, I have to quickly put in the trade, right? Because I'm going to go to the Hong Kong market already to see what's happening. All right. So there was a sell, um, alert in Kiwi Yen. Uh, just do a bit of a inspection. All right. Uh, in fact, before this recording, I've already done the inspection and it's, uh, seems quite a good trade with a good reward to risk ratio. The earlier move in the Kiwi Yen long, can you see this little bit of a, green arrow here so that's where I traded that as well and it moved quite nicely and today I'm going to trade the short side okay so I would drag in the um, calculator to calculate my lot size based on my risk and don't forget yesterday we still have the oil trade and the oil trade is still running but it's at a slight loss but it's fine because all the loss is uh, calculated so we just have to let the trade play out itself all right, here I have the um, order calculator loaded and I'm going to reach 1% of my um, account size for a stop loss of about 63 pips here. All right, as I have defined based on the tall method, uh, here I have the lot size of 0 0.64. All right, if I were to open on the market right now. Of course, that the best price to open was at the close of the 4 hour. Since I'm late, um, it's fine, all right, because then I just have to reduce the loss size a little bit, all right. So I'm just going to place in my trade, all right, just uh, click in a new order. All right, here I have everything key in. I'm just going to key in an arbitrary um, take profit, which is based on this number here. I might just adjust it accordingly when the price moves, but at this moment, I just have to define my risk and then um, with the lot size, just reduce that a little bit, all right and just click the sell market and my trade is true. We just have to watch for what happened. All right, so I have two trades right now. One is Kiwi Yen and the other one is um, on OI. Okay, now it's 5 p.m. In fact, that it's 5.12. Uh, I have another one more. I mean, a lot of alerts from the 5 p.m. signal here. So you can see that all these are all the alerts that I have to check it out. Um, but it's good. Let me just take a break from my son's um, PSLE revision and then um, I'm just going to come and check some of the trades here. All right, so I'll be placing in uh, those trades if they meet the criteria and we're just going to see what happened later on. Hello, it's me, Beanie, again at uh, 10.38. All right. I don't usually take a look at the market so late, but I think today is really very exciting. I put in quite a lot of trades. You can see my dashboard, which uh, shows the wash and rinse behavior. That's really a lot of trades, right? That came up tonight. Take a look at those that's in uh, yellow. So these are trades which are very recent. Uh, I mean that uh, we had the sell yesterday with the oil, all right? Um, and then uh, I had the trade with the UK 100, so that's the CFDs that's about uh, 12 hours ago. Then um, I had also the alert into the pound dollar, so that's about 5 hours. And in fact, that I didn't take moves of the alerts. I didn't, I just took, um, just uh, based on my risk. And uh, the other trades are really flying away, like uh, Euro Aussie, Euro CAD, um, the Aussies uh, trades as well. And also we had the Euro yesterday. So Euro and Sweezy, they're all doing very well. All right, so let's see what uh, my trade uh, are looking like. Okay, so I have few of them in the pound dollar sell and then the buy dollar yen. Um, and of course the gold trade. Then I have the Aussie sell. And lastly, I have the, um, the index, which is UK 100. Um, some of them are negative. Right, but just a bit of a loss here. Um, and uh, I'm just going to do a bit of reshuffling. All right. Uh, but uh, they're all within my limit. And the nice things about wash and means and what I've built here is you get to learn the lesson and then you have the trades pushed to you automatically. Um, let's uh, take a look into the trade that I did just now, which is on gold. So 
Can you guys see go here, the signal on go? Did I cover that up? Okay, yes, I think I did. So let me just look at go here. Alright, so that's the signal in go. Um, sell signal 4 hour and 40 minutes ago. So that's a 6 p.m. And I took this trip before I went for my exercise um, with my children. Alright, so let's take a look at the goal. Right, so obviously, goal had a huge drop. Um, as I mentioned, alright, goal had a horizontal level here. And where is that wash and rinse coming from? What happened was that on a Friday, because of the non-farm payroll, price had a push up. Alright, so we see this push up and price pushed right into a resistance. Okay, so that's into a resistance. But, um, that probably trapped many people because why uh, today we don't see that uh happiness among people who bought in on on friday all right because then price flipped the other side and we are just trading in that wash and rinse why is that so remember there's a lot of automations um there's a lot of uh, fake move in the market there's definitely a lot of tricks in the market and then um, they could see all these levels very nicely but what we don't have is that uh as human we are also uh greedy um sometimes we don't get to see many things easily right so um we can't uh, trade as well as those automations or those big funds or professional traders right so what we what they probably did is to push price all the way up to stop people stop out trades right which were short and and did those people who shorted were they right yes they were right today but they might have to, um uh, you know, gotten off their trades and lost a lot of money already on Friday. All right. So what I did is I traded that wash and rinse. So this candle here. So let me just go through this. Now this candle here, it's called a wash. All right. So W and then this one is pending a rinse. Okay. So that's a wash and rinse. And what, what we do, all right, is that we will go into the lower time frame, which is H4 to fine tune the trade and then to trade that in at this bar here. All right. So if you take a look at my dashboard, it identified this level 1817. Let's take a look at then it's 1817 here. All right. And then, um, let's, uh, have the trigger so that's uh uh six o'clock in singapore time and uh five hours ago all right so imagine that we have a have a sell here and then it has a huge drop down uh that's a really a very nice move to, okay and of course when where is that washed okay we can see very clearly price was pushed up all right that's the washed and then today it rains down okay so that's how uh, i have gotten my trade all right so we are using only one method and then across um, different pairs, different whether it's stocks or whether it is uh, forex or indices or whether that's a uh, commodity. All right. And then the nice thing is that you get all these uh, indications, all these alerts. So even if you are busy, right, you don't have time to have a look. You just have to have the tools that we are using. Okay. And, and you don't need to draw any lines but of course you have to understand the logic that's why we are having the lesson for you we don't only i don't want to just give you a black box i want to give you a lesson a comprehensive uh lesson so that you know how to use it uh for, for the hopefully to gain a skill and for the rest of your life okay so we are having a promotion right now uh, i hope that the promotion can continue which is to uh give a full cost refund which means that uh, if you meet the requirement all right which uh it's listed clearly in the website then you're gonna get the full cost refund uh at this moment okay so it's a limited time promotion do take the promotion and i hope to see you there uh, i will continue to update the trade but uh, it might not be in this video okay so let's take a look and have a final look at my uh trades right now so it's came down a little bit but then let's continue to monitor probably tomorrow it will do better i will just reshuffle a little bit of my trades here uh to keep the winners and then if some of them are not looking good i just uh, cut it off hello it's me again it's Bini. all right so new day what are we doing today we had many many trades yesterday all right, time now is uh, 1.15. Have you had your lunch yet? 
right, um, 8th of September, Wednesday. All right, so let's take a look at what happened and what's happened to my uh, position. Uh, so I slept um, with my positions. Of course, uh, last night I mentioned that I just take a look and see what happened. Uh, but I think that they're still fine, so I didn't modify. But in fact, that today when I woke up, uh, one of my position was uh, in profit and I have taken profit already. All right, so this is the position I have taken profit. Uh, you saw me execute this trade uh, for the UK 100. So it's to sell into the UK index. All right, um, and uh, where did I sell it? Uh, so let's revise a little bit. So this is the wash. In fact, that we can see a whole chunk of a resistance here. All right, so that's the wash and then I traded when it's somewhere around here okay so the reward to risk of this trade is about 2.5 so I'm, I'm quite happy because i actually take profit around here and i have about um 600 plus um dollar in my account already and what's happening in my uh, other trades let's have a look all right so this is my other trades that's still running i have um a shot in gold and then uh, sell in pound um, and buy in dollar yen um, and sell in Aussie uh, and then some of them are negative right um, so Aussie franc kiwi yen but net um, I'm quite happy with this because at least I'm with some nice uh, profit running at the moment we're gonna see what happened later on uh, when the European um, markets open all right more important I have um, completed with the uh, Hong Kong market so I've just put in my trade and now I'm back into the forex market already all right just want to share a little bit about what happened yesterday I was doing uh, my regular webinar with my um, the aliens uh, students <laughs> all right and then uh, we talk about the sell in Bitcoin so let me just show you what the uh, tall dashboard show us there was a sell in bitcoin here you can see that it happens about 16 hours ago and then a sell in xrp as well that came out okay that's a sell happens about 20 hours ago and do you see the action in the bitcoin last night okay let me just show you what happened wow 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 okay see the movement in bitcoin All right so after our sell signal that happened uh here okay and do you see that huge plunge okay so we had an earlier signal huge plunge in bitcoin well why was that and and why did it happen well it has to do with the el salvador um launching the bitcoin as its legal tender so um it uh, had a crash all right um but you know our system which is the tall system all right sort of uh, picked up this trade signal so if you have been or if you are trading in the Bitcoin that that would have gotten you a very very nice move of about seven, 10 to 17 percent it's been here on the 8th September it's the third day of my um, diary and it's the last section so far I hope that you have enjoyed it all right so I've enjoyed uh, capturing my diary my trade diary time now is 4 30 and um, as we head towards the five o'clock signal Right, uh, I just finished with the Hong Kong market and just uh, took quite uh, a nice profit for my futures trade. All right, so then now I'm coming back into the forex to take a look. Okay, now let's take a look into what's happening to my trades right now. Uh, we don't have any four hour uh, alert yet except for the hong kong and the cn50 but definitely the one hour is giving us a warning so we have a bit of a warning into euro yen and then aussie cat and as well as uh, uh aussie yen but uh, i don't think that these these are only warnings all right so um we, we just see what happened at the four hour but more important is to take a look at the trades that i did uh, that's from yesterday and the day before so uh, most of them are doing very well in fact that the pound dollar is going to reach my profit target uh, already all right so left about four pips to go i might just shift that later on uh, to get a little bit more money from there all right and then um the uh, the current one that's losing is the oil trade but i'm not too concerned about it because overall baskets are doing well uh, of course i also have the trade that i closed yesterday on the uh, 100 the short into the uk 100 so let's have a check on that all right so uh so this is the trade that i've closed yesterday or rather uh the night 
when I'm slipping. All right. So together with what I have right now, it's about near to a thousand eight. Uh, it's not a lot for the reason I'm putting in, but then uh, average we're gonna have about two to two plus uh, in terms of reward to risk ratio. We're gonna see how uh, the uh, the trades move. Okay, uh, but let me just talk about the course I'm offering. Of course, I'm trading, but I also put up a course uh, and hope that you can join the course. So let's move to the course portion. All right, here I am into my uh, website. Alright, so this is uh, the alien course, and that's the only one course that I'm uh, I've designed. Uh, all the course content, I came out with the method, and I'm actually teaching it. It's an online course. It means that once you have signed up for the course, you can just go online and uh, uh, study, and then go through the course yourself. Alright, but every week there would be a weekly two weekly live webinars, meaning that uh, I'll be doing the webinar session. We talk about what to trade and then there will also be revision and there will also be a webinar sessions for you to clear your doubts with me. All right. So all these are live. And then if you can't attend the session, of course, you can uh, watch the uh, recording. Okay. So let's talk about whether uh, the course is for you. So if you are new for uh, to Forex or if you're new to trading, I think the course is definitely suitable for you because it's built for people who are who don't totally have no idea in trading or even if you are already a seasoned traders right uh, I'm sure that the uh, wash and rinse concept is not something that uh, you've seen before all right and the way that we are trading it's different all right now so let's talk about the modules Right, the modules, the first module is free, so you can just take the first module. Alright, so we talk about the wash and rinse phenomena. Why uh, after the wash and rinse is often explosive, uh, then the wash and rinse in different financial instruments and how does a wash and rinse pattern look like uh, and how to increase the strength of the wash and rinse and examples of the trades in wash and rinse and that's my live trades too. Alright, so um, go and take that first module because it's free of charge. You don't need to uh, pay any, any money, but of course, then you know what wash and rinse is about. However, should you want to receive the set of tools that I'm using and to go into more detail of how to uh, execute the trades, because when in module one, it doesn't tell you any of such, okay? Uh, just to be very frank. So in the module two, that's where we learned about what is OB. All right. So OB is the key to our trade. How to analyze the multiple time frame. Why the wash and rinse happen? Because that's of the order flow within the day. Uh, then we have the auto box, the boxes that you see in the lower time frame. And then the uh, tall MTF, which would be the lines that are automatically plotted in a chart. All right, then how to formulate the tall traits and how to use the tall 3.0, which shows you the arrows and the ticks, right? Uh, to spot for traits. And of course, we have the tall dashboard, right? And then the trade example. But more importantly, right, with all this, you're going to get all the tools that I'm using as well as access to the weekly webinars, okay, the live webinars where I'll be guiding you along. All right, so I hope that you can join me in the course. The good news is that, all right, the course is right now having a promotion. It is 100% fully refunded, meaning that the course fee is 100% fully refunded. Uh, they are very easy to uh, fulfill criteria, all right, so they are not tough. And I have a lot of students who fulfill that criteria in just a day. Uh, I hope that after having this uh, trade diary, you know that how I'm trading, all right? And I totally subscribe to the fact that when you trade, um, we want to get the money, but we shouldn't be at the expense of our family, our loved one, and our life, okay? So I love that automations. I loved how I've programmed the whole thing to make sure that my trading is going to enhance my life. Uh, with money and as well as to improve my lifestyle. I hope to see you in the Alien Wash course. Hello, it's me again. You thought that, that was, that's going to be the last part? Okay, I really promise you that this is the last part. Today, 9th of September, I'm not going to do any recording because it's my son's birthday. All right, and the time is 1.45 right now. I'm just going to take a look at the market because I just finished my lesson. Okay, what do we have here? We have three trades that pop up. The franc seems that the market 
might be showing some move in the franc. We have the kiwi franc, pound franc, and the euro franc. All right. Of course, then all the indexes that I shorted did very well. All right. So just briefly show you what happened. So this is right now that's uh, running. Okay, and uh, I've added in euro yen yesterday. Right, and then if you take a look at the account that uh, was closed, let me just show you the account that's closed. Alright, so I have um, three trades TP and I took out the dollar yen just now. So about 1009 So that's really not bad for three days of effort. Then hope to see you in my course. Really, see you in my course. Alright, so if you can click the link um, that you're going to see in the uh, uh, link below. Alright, and that's where you can head to the course. Learn. Automate. Master trading with TAW course. Attend free at onlineforexmaster.com.